Rayman, we're getting close to Mr. Dark's hideout. I can feel it. Beware. If you choose level one, you'll have to carefully count the butterflies or mushrooms. If you go to levels two or three, you'll have to be right on target with your multiplication tables. To get through these dark caverns, use the electric flying saucer. Don't fall off, though, because there's no way out of those pits and chasms. To choose the answer to a problem, jump on the flying saucer that is under the correct number. Count the green mushrooms and go to the flying saucer with that number. Count the red butterflies. This time, count the yellow butterflies. Now, how many red mushrooms are there? Again, you need to count the green mushrooms. This time, count the yellow butterflies. Now, how many red mushrooms are there? Ah, 
let's see now. Oh, yes. Count the red butterflies. Careful! Each time you must count all the butterflies and mushrooms that you see. Then hop on the flying saucer that matches what you count. Rayman, watch the mushrooms and butterflies that you meet. Find the ones that are split into groups and have the same amount in each group.
Then go to the flying saucer that tells which mushrooms or which butterflies are split into groups this way.
Let's see. There are three times two of the same kind of mushrooms. But what color are they? Here, there are three times two of the same kind of butterflies. Find their color. This time, there are two times four of the same kind of mushroom. Now, find four times two identical butterflies. What color are they? What color are the two times six identical butterflies? Find three times five of the same kind of mushrooms. Look for five times three of the same kind of butterflies.
almost done. Find seven times one butterflies and don't forget their color. Deep in these caverns, five times three bubbles are hidden. Find them and take them, but only if you see five times three bubbles. Then look for the exit, and I'll wait for you there as usual. Congratulations!